What's the most painful thing you've ever been told? I don't love you. So when I broke up with my last girlfriend, one of the things she said to me was, I definitely never should have dated you, and I definitely never should have fucked you. That was mean, man, yeah. Damn, that's some deep shit. <laughs> you don't excite me anymore. How long ago was that? Well, I'm 30 now, so I, I don't know. I think I was like in my early 20s. Oh, really? Yeah. Damn. So I still remember it now, so that's... Oh, yeah. That was yeah. hard. Oh, yeah. No, that's the sort of thing that sticks with you. My husband told me he didn't know if he wanted to be married anymore. All right. Can I ask you a question real quick? It's just truth or dare. Truth. Who do you love most in life? My family. Truth or dare? Uh, truth. What's your happy place? Probably the beach. Is there any reason? Uh, no, I just like being there. It calms my mind. It's fire. Thank you, bro. Truth or dare? Truth. What's on your mind right now? Finishing my math homework. That's due tomorrow. Truth or dare? Truth. What's your happy place? My room with lots of music on. Truth or dare? Truth. When I say the word love, who's the first person you think of? My mom. Truth or dare? Uh, truth. What's a core memory you have? Uh, my little brother destroying my PlayStation. Truth or dare? Truth. Tell the person on the phone right now that you love him. Baby, I love you. I love you too. We just make videos. We just random people. You want me to ask you a question? What's your name? I'm Beast Mode. What's up? Truth or truth? Fucking always truth. Pick a number one through 17. 13. What would you say your toxic trait is? I'm a fucking dickhead, obviously. But I try not to be. Really? I really do try not to be. To be honest, bro, you seem like you're in like a bad mood right now. Are you? Yeah, unfortunately. Can I ask why? Hold up, let me not cry. Oh, really? All right, hold up. Everybody's so entitled. Everybody's so fucking important. You know, except for you, except for me. I'm tired of it. I feel that. I feel like it's a pretty good answer. I appreciate you. Yeah, I appreciate you too, man. All right, beast mode. I'll see you later. You drop this. She actually gave it back to me when I saw her, and she added a 10 to it. So we're gonna give it to the next person. Hey, yo, bro. Oh, yes, sir. Hey, I know you're working it all, but I think you dropped this, bro. Wow. Truth or dare? Uh, truth. When's the last time you cried? Uh, when my parents left. Uh, they dropped me off at college. Truth or dare? Truth. When's the last time you cried? Uh, like three hours ago. Can I ask why? Uh, because I'm a nervous wreck. When's the last time you cried? Yesterday. Why? Uh, I miss my grandmother. Truth or dare? Truth. When's the last time you cried? A week ago. It was my brother's wedding. You're a good brother. Truth or dare? Truth. When's the last time you cried? Probably like three weeks ago. Why? Someone died. Can I ask who? Third cousin, I think. But I knew them from like when I was a child. What's up to get through it? Just gotta keep moving forward. I'm quiet for a little bit and move on. Gotta live life. Thank you, bro. I'm staying. When is the last time you cried and why? When my dog died five years ago. Two days ago. Because my dog died in like ninth grade when my cousin passed away. Probably like a month ago. It was the three anniversary of my dad dying. Um, maybe a week ago because I was stressed. Eight months ago, my dog died. Um, I'd say probably two months ago because my dog died. Honestly, probably like a week ago when I saw a really sad dog TikTok. I don't even know, not gonna lie. It's been a very long time. Hey, excuse me. Yeah. Uh, we have this game, kind of just get to know people, and I want to play it with y'all. Can I? Okay. All right. Yeah. Hold on. What is your name? Emily. I'm Stan. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What is your name? Taylor. Taylor and Emily? Okay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay. Can you hold this? Yeah. Then you can hold this. So we have three levels. Each level kind of gets deeper with questions. And level one's icebreakers, level two is confessions, and level three is just getting deep. I'm just gonna get you to pick a random one and you read it and answer it. Okay. Who do you love most in life? Um, uh, my dog Kona and my boyfriend. Okay, what about you? My mom, because she's my best friend. Who do I love most in life? I would say my brothers, them two right there. They're triplets. I think I love them the most. I'm just Aww. closest with them with anybody I know. So. Yeah. All right, now it's level two. I'm gonna get you to pick it. Okay. Mm. All right. What's a memory you never want to let go of? Hmm, probably the day we adopted my little sister. It was an emotional day, but I was young, so. We're actually adopted. All three of you? Yeah. Oh, wow. How old's your sister? Eight. When'd she get adopted? Six, seven years ago. 
She was young, so like one or two. How so, old were you guys when you were adopted? I don't know. We were told six, five, but like I feel oh. like we were seven. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we were seven. <laughs> yeah. All right, what about you? I think you should go first. You think you should go first? Because <laughs> I'm still thinking. That's a memory I never want to let go of. I'm going to be real transparent with this one. So about a month ago, we came here to FSU. I met, the, met this girl in a hammock. <laughs> I helped her set it up and stuff. And then I just boldly asked her if I could sit in it with her. And so she said, yeah. Oh, and that's so sweet. We ended up sitting in there for like five hours. And oh my gosh. Yeah. You still talk to her? No. Oh, oh no. For some reason, she ghosted me. I don't know why. Oh, like, I really don't so know why. Sad. We, we were just like really so much, it was crazy. Talking for five hours, that's a long time. Yeah, especially like meeting them for the first time too. Yeah, that's a memory I never, never want to let go of. I want to hear you answer um, I went on a trip over spring break with my family. We body surfed the waves for like probably three hours straight. So much fun. There were like s turtles swimming below us and we saw like a whale in the background. It was like the coolest thing ever. That is so, yeah, cool. never want to forget that memory. All right, we're going to go to level three. These are like getting deep. I guess I'm going to make you pick it. Okay. What are the toughest demons you're fighting? Wow. <laughs> you want to go first, Emily? Sure, I guess so. Mine are simple. Anxiety, loneliness, depression. When does it hit the most? At night, when she's not in the dorm and I'm sitting there alone. I really want to go home. I'm really homesick. How do you usually deal with it? <clears throat> I cry a lot. And she just watches me. No, I do not. <laughs> That's relatable. Yeah. What about you? I'd probably just say self-image. Like okay. loving yourself, like fully. So okay. calm. I feel like the ones I'm finding are recent. Recently I've been feeling like really unfulfilled and I don't know why. I've always felt really good about like what we do. Usually it's stuff like this. We kind of talk to strangers, yeah. make people's days. We try to, but recently it hasn't been like hitting at all. Like I felt a little bit empty. Yeah. But I've just been taking a step back, just observing my thoughts. I journal a lot now. I'll just do what I call brain dumps, where it's, I just write all my thoughts. That's so healthy. You do that? No, I used to. I haven't done that in a while. I, I think I think that might help with like... Me? Yeah. yeah, I have a journal sitting in our room. I just have never used it. It's <laughs> just totally sitting should. there. I think tonight you should just say fuck it and just do it. Just, she's going to be gone again tonight. Look, I'm going to be all by myself. That'd be a great time to do it. Yeah. Well, yeah, those are my demons. What y'all think? Uh, that was good. I like the game. Really? It's fun. It's a good game for us because we're deep thinkers. We yeah, sit in our we, dorm and oh, we talk yeah. for hours about stuff. We love it too. Yeah. We love talking.